Well, the family and I are going on a little road trip. This is one of the lakes that we're passing. This is Birch Lake. And there's some hills in the background. There's some ducks right there. They're all taking a siesta. Let's see. They're all mama ducks. I don't see any babies around though. Beautiful mama ducks. Let's see if we can, the water is really high. We've had a lot of rain. There's some houses over there. And there's houses over there. And there's the duckies still. All right. I'm getting back on the highway. It's kind of a clear yet overcast day today. So I'll see you at the next stop. Hey guys, we've made it to Delta Junction, or we're right outside of Delta Junction. There's the bridge. And there's the hill that we've climbed. There's geocaches up there. People have tagged that hill. My son throwing rocks in the water. The water's moving super fast today. It's really high. Let's see if you can see how fast it's going. Right up above me is the Trans-Alaska Pipeline. It travels over this river. It comes out a little bit over there to the right. Where's my finger? Comes out a little bit over there. And then it comes over the Tanana River. And then it travels that way, heading up to Valdez. We're actually on a road trip to Palmer to go see um, Shine Down in concert. concert. Haven't been to a concert in years. Over on the other side of the river, the Tanana meets the Delta River. I'm not going to climb the hill to show that. Maybe next summer I'll do that. Not today. So here's the water and it is moving super, super fast and it is super, super full. And the pipeline flow, or and the oil flowing up over it. All right, guys. Until our next stop. See you later. No trip to Delta can happen without stopping for a burger at the Buffalo Center Drive-In. We just stopped. We're getting some burgers to go. Then we will be on our way. We have a little eating spot over there. And then there's a museum over there so we're getting down the road let's see if I can get in the mountains oh no I can't get the mountains I'll show the mountains in a little bit they already have snow on them germination dust is arriving it is
is fall in our section of Alaska. See you next stop. Hi guys, it's me again. Hi guys, it's me again. Down there is the Delta River. And up above that is the Delta, I'm sorry, the Alaska Range part of it. It's really overcast over there and very smoky and foggy. Let's see if I can bring in there's snow on those mountains up there. Down at the bottom you can see the pipeline. Again. So the snow on these mountains stay on all year long. And it is part of the Alaska Range. It goes all the way this way. And the Delta River and then right up there is some more of the Alaska Range. I'll try to get some better pictures along the way. All right signing off for now I'll bring you back over to the snowy mountains. There you go. We'll be closer soon. See you later. Hi guys. We're in an avalanche zone now. That's called Rainbow Mountain. And when it's wet and the sun is hitting it at just the right angle, it looks like a rainbow. My husband sent me a picture of it and I will send a picture or I'll insert a picture of it whenever I do this. And here's, I don't know what, is this Delta? Failing Creek. Failing? Failing. Failing Creek. P H A E P H E L A N Creek, Phelan Creek, and it looks cold. Look at all the pretty colors. Oh, there goes the boy throwing rocks in. Look at all the pretty colors. I told you guys it was fall. no snow. Not right here. And there's some more right there. There's the boy. There's the husband. Alrighty. Time to get back on the road. Rainbow Mountain again. And lots of pretty, pretty fall colors. And cars going by. stop. Oh, isn't Alaska beautiful? I wouldn't trade it for anything in the world. We stopped for a couple of minutes. These are the Chugach Mountains. 
We're about an hour out of Palmer right now. The smoke is pretty bad. Up there, you can see the outlines. Let's see. There you go. The outlines over there are hard to see. Oh, and I'll go over this way. I guess Devil is going in the woods. So these are the Chugach Mountains. And somewhere around here is the Matsu River, and it separates the other mountains that are right there. You said they're Talkeetna? For fifth time, yes. Well, I'm sorry, I forgot. So these are the Talkeetna mountains over here on this side of the highway. And there's that funny looking mountain. And the other ones in the way background. Let's see. Here's one right there. Sorry, it's wobbly. But I'll go out. So you can see the back view. Or the back view where the range, Chugach Mountain Range in the background. And the Talkeetna Mountain Range right there. again. Hi everyone. It's kind of hard to see, but that is part of the Matanuska, Matanuska Glacier. And there's part of the mountains again. We gone, we have gone maybe about a half a mile down the road from where we were. But I thought that I would try to get the glacier in for you. That's as close as I can get. Alrighty, heading back on the road. See you again soon at the next stop. Bug guts. There's part of the glacier, isn't it? Yeah. It's a little bit better. the way the sun is coming from the clouds through all that smoke. Alrighty. There's some glacier over there. Palmer and now since Cindy of Cindy Hearts Crochet didn't take me to Arby's I had to drive eight hours to go to the nearest Arby's so dinner 
and then tomorrow breakfast lunch and dinner and the next day breakfast and lunch and then on our way back to North Pole so we're at Arby's Beef and Chatter City baby